Hello guys, Microsoft has officially released Windows 10 now. So in this video, we will look what are the top features in Windows 10. So the first thing you may be curious about is the start menu. Is it back or is it not? So let's directly go to this start menu button and click it and bam, the start menu is back and your tile menu is also there. So it's a mix of Windows 7 start menu and Windows 8 tile menu. And in here you can uh, search for all your uh, apps which are installed in your uh, system or you can search on the basis of the letter they start with like this. Okay, so for example, I want to search an app which start with letter M. I can choose it and I can see all the apps which start with M. I have this uh, tile menu here, but it's not covering the whole screen. So this is a very good feature here. Now the best thing which I liked about this uh, start menu is it's resizable. So you can uh, resize it according to your requirement. So you can resize it from the top and you can even resize it from the side. Okay, so this is a very good feature. Now, for example, I open some apps from here. For example, this folder explorer and I open this calculator. This calculator also I wanted to show you that this is uh, totally changed. And in here you can see different, uh, you know, modes you can use this calculator. Now the good thing is it's also resizable. So you can resize it. Earlier version of Windows have calculators, but they can't be resized, right? But this calculator you can resize. And one more feature of this calculator is when you do something and it stores the history. So you have the history of all your previous uh, work and you can even delete your history also. So for example, I click this button and you can delete this history. Now one more feature which I want to show you is this task view here. So when I click this task view, I can see all the tasks or all the apps which are running at this time in my Windows operating system. So this is also a nice feature. And I can also drag these, uh, for example, I want to drag this file explorer on the side, then it automatically uh, aligns all the other apps on the left hand side. Or if I want to uh, drag it on the right, then it will align all the apps on the right hand side, right? So you can, uh, you know, resize your app according to the space uh, available on your uh, window, right? So this is also a nice feature. One more good feature is when you click this task view, you can have multiple desktop, which is very nice. So for example, I have a second desktop now, which is totally clean. And I can go to my first desktop from here, which uh, in which I have my calculator and my folder explorer. So in this way, I can add multiple desktop from here and I can even drag my apps from here. So from first desktop, I can drag the app to the second desktop, right? So it will go to the second desktop and you can even close all these desktop like this. Okay. Now one more very new feature in uh, this Windows 10 is Microsoft has launched their new browser, which is Microsoft Edge. And this is totally different from Internet Explorer. You also have Internet Explorer here if you want to search. Internet Explorer is also there in Windows 10, but there is a new browser, which is uh, this Edge browser from Microsoft which is quite new. So for example, I want to uh, see some news. I can go there and very cool feature about this is you can have this reading view mode here. So you can click this and you will go to the reading mode like this. Okay. So when you are reading something, 
you can enable this reading mode right now one more very nice feature about this uh, browser is it has this make a web note so when you click this button make a web note you can have these options for example uh, this pen option is enabled right now so i can write on my web page like this so i want to underline this i can you know underline this this has the highlight option also so i can highlight any text i want and this has other option also for example erase or uh, notes so you can make make your own notes so i can add my own notes here and i can type here so this is good when you are studying something or you are learning something you can make note and you can even save these notes uh, on microsoft edge so this is really a nice feature you can exit from here and when you click this button you have all your uh, regular features like mail or one note and other features right and this three dots you have more options like new windows or print or pin or other options like settings right so this is totally new for windows 10 now one more very good feature they have is which i liked very much which i was missing uh, in the older windows is the command prompt so you have this command prompt here and it's resizable so earlier versions of windows has command prompt but it was not resizable now it's resizable and you also have the option to copy and paste something so for example i have something on my notepad and i want to paste it on my command prompt i can just copy and paste it here so this is also a very nice feature one more nice feature they have is this button here which is new button added to windows 10 and in here you can see all your uh, settings and all your uh, important you know apps which you can use from here so for example i want to open all settings from here and it will open all settings and this is uh, different from control panel uh, in the user interface and user experience so for example i want to personalize my desktop i can do this so for example i want to change this start menu from here to the full screen menu i can do this simply when i go to start and i can enable use start full screen so i can enable it and when i go to my start button once again it will turn to the full screen right and i can go to once again to the setting and turn it off and once again i can click this button here and it will go back to your normal start menu right so you can personalize uh, this stuff according to yourself for example background images or colors or lock screen will look like this but they have some different pictures from here and the other stuff now for example you want to uninstall some app which you have installed how you can do it you can go back to the settings once again and you can go to system here and you can go to apps and features and in here you will be able to see all the list and you can even filter your list from here and whenever you click on some app for example this i have the option to move or uninstall some apps which you uh, add using a third party uh, installer then you can uninstall it for example they allow to uninstall this microsoft solitaire collection from here you can press this button and it will be uninstalled so these are the new features which i liked about windows 10 i hope you have enjoyed this video please rate comment and subscribe and bye for now